Hi, I'm Dr. Gabby Cora, and we're at the National Publicity Summit here with Ronnie Tsunami. Ronnie, welcome. Aloha. <laughs> so, Ronnie, you have a very interesting background and mission to share. Go for it. Yes, uh, I'm originally from Honolulu, Hawaii. Uh, I live in Charlotte, North Carolina, and I run happiness workshops. What does that mean, uh, happiness workshops? Yeah, well, I developed a framework for people to uh, create their own happiness rather than find it. Uh, and it revolves around creating goals, clearing your mind, um, making sure that you're physically healthy, finding things to do for fun, and knowing what you would love to do, and then sharing those with others, building relationships. So it's a framework, and what makes it a little different is that we do it tropical style. So, uh, <laughs> what does that mean? I want you to imagine Tony Robbins meets Jimmy Buffett. It's a motivational seminar workshop, but it's done in a tropical setting. So we do it at resorts, at uh, hotels, we'll do it where, with, where? Uh, you know, anywhere from Wilmington to Key West to Hawaii and Maui. And we do workshops that basically invite people to, if you can imagine a Jimmy Buffett tailgate party, uh, where we have hula dancers, we have a live tropical band, we have steel drums playing, we do a big luau, and all the activities are tropical or island inspired. Uh, and so we really want to put people in their happy place because we believe that people uh, are more open to ideas when they are relaxed and de-stressed and, and that's really what the workshop is about is helping people to relax and de-stress. And bring back the happiness within them. Yes, and we, what we find is people are overworked, overstressed, overweight and basically overwhelmed and what we try to do is help them through the workshops to uh, de-stress, to find ways to enjoy life rather than kind of trudging through it and we do that with uh, I don't know about you an island lifestyle to me like here in Manhattan a walk around and people are one of the guests mentioned that are frantic you step off and you're you know the plane and you get into your cab and right immediately you can feel of your blood pressure you know rise and everyone's tense and you get on the street and people are walking fast and it's like you know, you kind of look in people's eyes and see, are they enjoying it? Do they, is this what they love or are they just kind of going with the pace and everyone kind of gets drawn into it and is, you know, walking just as fast as they are. So can you see through those eyes or is it just like a... A glaze. Like, <laughs> there I, you go. But I'm new. This is my first time to New York, so I'm, maybe it's just shock. First impression. First impression and uh, I'm like, you know what? Yeah, this is maybe a big island, right? Man, <laughs> island, but... Uh, people are, you know, worried about money, they're worried about work and the economy and, uh, you know, people could use a little more island music. So, so, Ronnie, why don't you share with us how you got to the point where you thought of creating happiness workshops? Uh, I was in IT, so in technology. I used to be the lead network engineer for the Secretary of Defense, worked at the Pentagon. So, totally different lives. Totally computer, business, technology and worked for Microsoft. Uh, was a manager at Microsoft, basically managing the um, Microsoft relationship with NASA, served as an account manager for NASA. So, very intense. Uh, very intense, very intense frantic, frantic life, frantic, uh, overwhelmed, overworked. Overworked, 80 hours a week, was a CIO as well, and director of the Congressional Commission for Veterans Affairs, so it was very driven. So you've been there. Been there, and... Uh, you know, what the, you know what, how the, what the glaze looks like. I was there and uh, lived through it. And about five years ago, I literally went on overload. was so overwhelmed that I shut down and I dropped it. Instead, I became a musician. I said, you know what, forget this, I need to pursue my passion. I became a musician, Ronnie Tsunami of the Tsunami Wave Riders. And it's an island party band, relaxed. My wife and daughter played steel drums and I had a seven piece band. We, um, you know, we won a couple of awards, Single of the Year at the Hawaii Music Awards and Top Beach Band in North America and Best World Music Artist. And so we had a great time. It was a fun time. But as I went around the country, I noticed people were just stressed up, period. And these people would come to me going, give me a margarita. You know? I said, really, you know, well, what's your problem? And, and so I made it my goal to basically de-stress people through music. And a year ago, I developed the workshops based on my experiences with uh, traveling around the country. And I took my business and project management background and basically built a framework. Because before, even when I was in computers, 
I had built a number of training programs that were rolled out to about 2,000 colleges worldwide. Uh, the Microsoft IT Academy program and Culminus and others. So I took that and built a happiness framework because people like to follow the system. And we'll see how it goes, but so far, you know, we've done it for companies as part of their wellness program. Uh, it basically combines their employee appreciation day with a wellness program to help people de-stress and relax, and uh, now I'm doing it for the public. Well, the, the best part is we can look through your eyes now, so there's no glaze there. You're having fun, you're no, enjoying your own happiness, can't aren't complain. you? It's, <laughs> you got to enjoy life, and life is short. Bernie, how can people get in touch with you? They can go to rideanyway.com, uh, and livingaloha.com is a community that I've set up for people trying to find their happy place, create their own happy place. Uh, write any way of those where I have my schedule, workshops, we post videos, tips on how to create that island feel, how to uh, live on island time, no matter where you are, if it's in Ohio or Key West or Michigan, you know, in the dead of winter, we believe you can create your own happy place anytime, anywhere. Wonderful. Thank you so much for joining us, Rob. <laughs>